Welcome to Hogwarts Legacy. This is Jim. So this is the second episode. And we're just carrying off from where we left off in uh, episode one. So we're in the uh, Gryffindor room. And uh, if you look at the uh, bottom left-hand corner of the screen, we can open up and see what uh, mission we're on. So we're welcome to Hogwarts. I need to head to the, my common room. Sounds as though as there are some voices coming from nearby. Perhaps I should follow them. Then we can then disappear. And another great option I just want to uh, show folks is uh, you can actually uh, save this game, <clears throat> which is great. Uh, so I like that. Gives you uh, several save uh, slots here, which is pretty awesome. That's that's kind of what I like, and I was kind of hoping for. And then. Um, left-hand corner of the screen uh, going all the way down yeah, you can change uh, you know certain uh, options I guess audio gameplay and then the controls uh, stuff like that so very uh, very good I like that I like that especially the save option all right all right let's uh, Rebellion. do a little exploring here I don't think there's a whole lot in this room. Uh, pretty cool. So this was my, this is where my fella here woke up. It's right here. <clears throat> nice. World. Oh, it's uh, huh. <clears throat> it's like a ghost. Let's uh, let's follow him. <laughs> Revelio. Gotta go up though, but uh, let's do here. Yeah, well, huh? Pretty sharp. Nice, very well built. <laughs> uh, all right, let's head up here, sprint up the stairs. Which way is the common room? Oh, that's cool. Revelio. That's really cool, I like that. That is like so cool how the pictures move like that. Like, <laughs> that is so neat. I don't know what it is, but I really like that. That's such an awesome touch. Ah! Oh, looks like there's a uh, chest there. Rebellion. Level one lock. Okay, so it's locked, and you obviously don't have. Uh, I don't know if it's considered pick lock or whatever, but what's up? fire I guess that's cool introduce yourself to Cressidia Gareth and uh, Nelly oh, that's so cool this is awesome loving this like look at this room it's amazing Wow all kinds of other folks down here this guy here is out of her I'll have what he's having. 
Nice. Oh, that's cool. Doesn't really... I'm not... I don't know if it does anything to your health, but I'm uh, full health anyway, but... Uh, Let's talk to some people here. Let's uh, climb up there. I don't know if we can climb up there. Can we climb? Alright, let's go over here first. <laughs> talk. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. It's not a complicated spell. I should be able to do it non-verbally. Why is this not working? Ugh! Oh, hello there. Welcome to Gryffindor. I'm Cressida. Pleasure to meet you, Cressida. Splendidly theatrical arrival to the sorting ceremony last evening. Made it in by the skin of your teeth. <laughs> is it true that you're Professor Fig's protege? Studied with him? Not at all. Well, yeah, studied with I'm him not a sure bit, I guess. That but I did a study with him a little before we arrived. Blast! I was hoping he might have given you some advice on non-verbal casting. Is that what you were trying to do just there? Oh, yes. Having a spot of trouble. I've mastered the charm using its incantation, but this is proving a bit trickier. Sure you'll get it. Perhaps you just need a bit more practice. Casting needs work. I will be positive here. Don't worry. We'll get it in the end. Oh, I hope so. <clears throat> if I can get it, Professor Ronan's sure to be very impressed. I'm just going to keep at it. I wish you luck. How hard is it to cast nonverbal spells? Can most students cast nonverbally? Do like most me. students know how to cast nonverbally? Not at all. Hogwarts doesn't teach nonverbal casting until the sixth year. And even then, many struggle with it. I'm simply trying to get ahead of the game. Hmm. Oh, I wish you luck then. Well, good luck with it. It was nice to meet you, Cressida. You as well. Enjoy your first day. Cool. Nice. Sip. Go on. Sure, you don't want to try it? Brewed it myself. <laughs> Hello. You're the new fifth year. Pleased to meet you. I'm Gareth Weasley. Heard about your travels here. Can't believe it. Glad you and Fig are all right. Is it true that someone from the ministry was with you in the carriage? Oh, uh, yes. A friend of Professor Fig's. Oh, didn't mean to pry. Nasty business, dragons. Again, very glad you're here. Thank you, Gareth. So am I. Are you related to Professor Weasley? I am. She's my aunt. Must be nice. Must be awkward. Then you can do whatever you want. Well, must be nice. Must be nice having an aunt for a professor. You'd think so, wouldn't you? Aunt Matilda tends to treat me as if I'm a first year. Keeps too close an eye on me. It's all a bit suffocating, to be honest. Still, she means well. And she's an incredibly powerful witch. She'll have your back. Hmm. Nice meeting you, Gareth. What's that on your mug? You have a knack for potions, too. Seems you enjoy brewing. Might I assume that you've a talent for potions of all sorts? Well, as I see it, there's little difference, fundamentally, between brewing a modification to Butterbeer and a Wiganweld potion. Sweet. Though, 
I'm not certain Professor Sharp would make the connection. He doesn't appreciate my uh, creativity as much as you might think. <laughs> oh, awesome news for you there, bud. Nice meeting you. Well, it was nice meeting you, Gareth, and thank you for the insights on your aunt. Pleasure to meet you as well. Good luck today. All right, that's that. Stop, Nelly. Find a way up there, but. Don't fall off this time, Nelly. <laughs> Why is everyone so highly strung? It's perfectly safe. <laughs> Well, hello. Don't mind me. I find it helpful to change my point of view now and again. Put things in perspective. Once I made it to the top of Gryffindor Tower, from the outside, huh. without a broom. Goodness. <laughs> I'm Nelly, by the way. Nelly Ogspire. I've heard rumors about what happened to you on your way to Hogwarts. Is it true? About the dragon? It's true. It's terrifying. There's nothing I could handle. <laughs> it is true. <clears throat> Our carriage was attacked by a dragon. Crikey! I can't believe it. How thrilling! Crikey. And also <clears throat> terrifying. Uh, anyway, you've certainly brought some much-needed excitement to Gryffindor. And Hogwarts, for that matter. Nice to meet you. What are people saying about my travels here? Not afraid of heights, are you? Have you ever encountered a dragon? What exactly are the rumors about my journey to Hogwarts? Uh, that you escaped a dragon attack? Huh. Isn't that enough? Most of us arrive via train or boat. Not having just escaped the jaws of a dragon. Of course it's got people talking. Word travels fast at Hogwarts. Good to know. Nice to meet you. I'm sure I'll be seeing you around. Either in our common room or when you scale your next tower. <laughs> you never know. Bye for now. New Gryffindor, Professor Weasley's waiting for you outside the common room. All right. They're a bit dense, but ever so picturesque. Cool. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Huh. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Nice. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Sweet. This way. All right. That's the door to our uh, common area. <laughs> that lady there in the wall. There's uh The guide will give you opportunity that to is practice cool. your magic. That's cool. I like that. Educate yourself about wizarding. That's neat. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. 
Do keep up. Ah, the guide appears to have some information for you about that painting of poor Barufio. <laughs> what is going on here? Simply cast Revelio on it, <laughs> and we'll see what the guide says. Revelio. Elect. Portrait of Rufio. Guide pages. Portrait depicts the wizard Rufio. Or however you say it. Famed for his brain elixir. And as an example of what's happening, incantations are properly spoken. He once said instead of F and found himself on the floor with a buffalo on his chest. Huh. Just like that. You've unlocked the field guide challenge. Progress towards completing challenges appears here. Perfect. Level 1. 80 XP. I love it. But field guide pages in Hogwarts. One of two. Field guide challenges are our only way to acquire experience points or XP. Open field guide. This is your wizarding level. Or some one XP earned from challenges increases your level and power. Sweet. Okay, I can't really move around here. Let's see what we got here. Quest, no assignments, outposts, settings, challenges, collections. Ah, oh, that's cool. Challenges. Well, let me pick anything else. No. All right. Selecting your first guide page unlocks a new challenge category. New challenges you unlock through your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. Well, it forces us to pick these guys here. Huh. Discover field guide pages around the world. Field guide pages, 1% unlocked challenge. Collect field guide pages in Hogwarts 1. Collect two field guide pages in Hogwarts 2. And gear appearance reward. Hogwarts regalia spectacles. Huh. Interesting. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlocked at each tier you complete. From appearance to critical upgrades. God, that's awesome. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards you have unlocked. And we will be unlocking rewards as we get them. Exit the field guide. Okay. Nice. Let's see if we can open that up again here. Okay, there we go. That's that button. Sweet. Black leather gloves. This item has no magical properties, so we can. The sell value of 30, so we can equip it or we can destroy it. Well, we only have one, so let's uh, put them on. Nice. Baseware. Alright, we got those uh, gold rim circular spectacles. We're not going to bother. Headwear. Got here. Dark flat cap. That is no magical value. There, let's put this hat on. <laughs> yeah, that's fine with the hat. Progress through the main story to unlock. Okay, so we can't. Uh, don't have any wand handles. We had 172 gold. Health 200. Defense zero. <laughs> Neckwear. Nothing is selected. Let's uh, see what we got here. Natural beige scarf. Eh, that's all right. Cloaks and robes. Traditional school robe. Well pointed. All right. So this is what I'm wearing now. And of course, the outfit. 
perfect fest uniform, well pointed. This is what I'm wearing now. Okay. Flying mounts, not uh, aggressive main story to unlock. And same with the broom. Broom upgrades, looks like there's three upgrades. Pretty cool. Inventory. Talents, zero for zero across the board, except for here. <clears throat> oh, additional content. So this is the, uh, this is the rewards that I unlocked. Pretty cool. Dark side robe. Dark art gloves. Dark Arts Ensemble. Mask here. Dark Arts Mask. Beaked Skull Mask. Dark Arts Garrison Hat. Hat one by those touched by Darker Side of Magic. <laughs> uh, Dark Arts Hat. Yeah. What happens if I. Uh, Alright, these are just collections, I guess, but uh, I don't know if you can actually put these on. Or if you have to hold it. No. Huh. Alright. Challenges. Nice little map here. Oh, there we go. There's our map. Welcome to Hogwarts. Cool. Little areas here. The Great Hall. Touchy there, the grand uh, staircase, south wing. <clears throat> Bell Tower, Library Annex. And it shows the little area how many like uh, chests, field pages, statues, and uh, tables in each uh, area. That's pretty cool. Cool. Like Quests. Hogwarts is the quest that we're on. The show is required level, which is cool. I like that. Settings. Where you can save your game. Wonder if it'll let us change that now. Oh, I wonder if you have to progress through. I'll have to play around with it for a little bit to see. <clears throat> All right, that's fine. Let's get out of here. All right. Got all this, uh, Professor Weasley. Eyes open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Yeah, sounds good. Let's pet this cat here. Might as well. Listen here, lady. I'm gonna pet this cat here. <laughs> oh. Awesome. Oh. Search this chest. 43 gold. Perfect. I don't know the, uh. The f Good timing. Yes. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Sweet. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. You discovered uh, f f uh, flu, flu flames. Jesus. Fast travel point. You can open the map at any time to fast travel to any discovered flu flames. Huh. Hogwarts <clears throat> defining the two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live. Includes the house, the house common rooms, and the Great Hall. Select the South Wing region to continue. South Wing. 
this view you can see the flu flames available in that region green flu flames represent flames you have discovered including your own house common room gray flu flames reveal the location of undiscovered flames Unlock the central flame. Okay. Use R to rotate the map. Fast travel. Oh, cool. The central hall. Blue flames. Oh, that's cool. You can, uh. Huh. Now that's, uh, that's, that's neat there. That's, uh, that's pretty neat. Okay. Let's, uh, travel to that green flame down there. That's the what that Professor Weasley has unlocked. Oh, geez, what happened there? Sorry about that. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll get this back. That's the guy, the one. All right. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. I brought us back to the beginning, I guess, to that little part there. <laughs> Different kind of cat there this time. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. I hear you, lady. I wonder if it'll let us do that again. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Right. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Maybe we'll just do it quickly here. All right. Select the south wing. Over here. All right. Let's go down here to this green flame. We'll travel. Doesn't kick us out this time. Jesus. And here we are, quite the time saver. Perfect, yeah, it is. Yeah. Lead directly to Central Hall. Nice. You can get <laughs> to almost anywhere in the castle quickly. Bar, we were kicked Hall. out. This is where we should have came. Oh, it didn't take us too long. Oh, something happening oh. here. It's the heart uh, of the hive. Oh, Rebellious station, so to speak. Oh. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Thank you, Professor. You tell me more about Charms class. Where exactly is Defense Against the Dark Arts? What's uh, Hogsmeade? It's, uh, you mentioned this. Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain, and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. Sweet. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Thank you, Professor. Can you tell me more about Charms class? What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes. All terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. What exactly is Defense Against the Dark Arts? Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? 
Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Hmm. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Thank you, Professor. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day. And you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. There is, in fact. I'm afraid there isn't. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Huh? Exploring ruins? Well... I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Try to leave him alone. <laughs> Speak of the devil. <laughs> Professor Fig, your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today, and remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you, and invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned, and we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Talk to Professor Fig. Let's <clears throat> look around here for a second here. Revelio. Hmm. That's a chest down there. <laughs> well. My parents are All right. So we have to stay in the quest area. Rebellion. Cool. All right. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? Nope. It was nothing, sir. I hope it didn't say too much. She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, exactly. Well, Professor Weasley <clears throat> is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. Astute, we don't eh? Know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, 
And so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the Field Guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Sounds good. You can track available quests from the map. That symbol represents main quests. Completing main quests will further the story. Lock new features and grant XP. Continue. Some quests are locked by spell and or level requirements. In these cases, you will need to be the required level and or have the required spell to activate the quest. New spells can be earned by completing professor's assignments or as quest reports. Check a quest with A to continue. Defense against the dark arts classes. The field guide map shows Professor Pickett's class in the lower section of the astronomy wing. Get lost in this castle. I may need to use the charmed compass and the field guide to help me find the way. This guy here, charms class. Professor Ronan's class in the astronomy wing. Castle is enormous. May need A. The well. map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. <clears throat> Quest complete. Welcome to Hogwarts. Perfect. Charm compass. New item unlock. Charm compass will lead you to anything you're tracking. Huh. Open up that map again. Side quests are now available. <clears throat> available side quests can be found inside regions of Hogwarts marked as the flag and discovered by exploring the world. These quests reward XP but do not advance the main story. All right. be as difficult as it seems hello I don't believe we've met oh hello I'm Lenora pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy <laughs> Samantha thinks I'm potty but it's this painting I never noticed it before if I know Hogwarts and I do an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason there's something more to this perhaps I'll have a look have you learned anything about it? There are paintings like this here. Have you learned anything about any it? insights about the painting since <clears throat> you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. Oh, perfect. But I'm not sure what to do next. Perhaps I'll have a look. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Do come and find me if you stumble on something hmm. illuminating. Like a moth to a flame. Lumos. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Sounds good. I wonder if we can, um, P. 
hitting revealed an image of what appears to be a location in the central hall. I should search the area to see if I can find it. Find the location depicted in the painting. Rewards. Appearance. Appearances. Alright, so that's uh, tracked. Alright. This looks like the location from the painting. It does. What could be so special about it? Revelio. Blacked. Statue of Gregory the Smarry. Smarry? <laughs> Guide page. Statue with an integrated grain depicts the medieval wizard Gregory the Sm Smarry. The wizard famous for inventing Gregory's. Oh my lord. <laughs> a potion that makes the drinker believe whoever gave them the potion is their best friend. <laughs> uh, challenge complete. As you can see, how uh, the level has increased. Statue of Gregory. Right. Let's. Uh, Let's check our field guide here. Collections. Statue, okay, perfect. It's the pages. Hogsmeade. Okay. Inventory. Nothing here. All right. Complete two main story quests. Get legendary gloves. Huh. Collect two field guide pages in Hogwarts complete. Hogwarts Gallia Spectacles. And we got uh, collect eight field guide pages in Hogwarts. We need to collect eight more to get uh, Hogwarts Gala gloves. Cool. Right on the map here for a second. Okay, that's still highlighted here. I still got to figure out how I can select the uh, clothes that we that we had gotten through the reward system. I can take it right off. Cool. Oh, interesting. All right. Out the fool with that some other time. Rebellion. Huh. find the location depicted in the painting. I think we did that already, did we? Rebellion. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm more than pleased to be included. Huh?
Or if there's something else that we're missing from that uh, painting. Ha! Huh. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Cool. Huh. It's like I was missing something there. Perfect. Oh yeah, level two, baby. Woo! Oh, and that mirror disappeared. Talk to little Nora. All right. Sweet. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did. It did. Wow. It was a fluke. <laughs> Follow the clues. I found the location uh. you depicted in the painting, <laughs> and then I cast Lumos to guide him off back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. A pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to overexplain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth. I should have seen that. Quest complete. Like a moth in the flame. All right, sweet. Get a little bit of XP for that. Lead to the side. Nice, nice. So let's check that again. Cobalt regalia, an ensemble for those who poise the refinement earned by solving the mystery of the empty painting frame. Hmm. Cool. That's what we uh, got for that uh, completed that little quest there. Head back over to quests. So well, now that's gone. Just got the two main ones here. Attend your first aid Hogwarts and Charms classes. Attend. Okay, get that stuff there. So, what we'll do is um, <clears throat> we're almost 50 uh, minutes here. What we'll probably do is we'll won't start a class uh, right now. We'll probably start that in the next episode. But at least we're able to uh, complete uh, Moth of the Flame. Uh, mini quest there so it's pretty cool and uh, we leveled up to level two which is pretty awesome and uh yeah really liking this game really liking it loving it actually hope you enjoyed the video please like subscribe and share when you have the chance it really helps me out i hope you all have a nice day